nonviolent and nonpolitical spiritual practitioners and nonpolitical spiritual practitioners. No one is making money off of it. It is not political. They are not interested in politics. Political intention. We are also not against the government. We just try to improve ourselves, cultivate our heart, heart, try to be a good people. or a beneficial practice promising health and spiritual growth. face life-threatening health problems. He had cirrhosis of the liver and it became stage one cancer. The doctors diagnosed him and said he wouldn't live, wouldn't live very much longer. He practiced Falun Gong and was healed. Falun Gong is not a religion. It's not a cult or a sect. There is no organization to join. There are no rituals or worship services. No one is making money off of it. It is not political. If anybody tries to make money or personal gain from the practice, that's that's an incorrect approach. You're not you're not a practitioner. You're not doing falun dafa if that's your attitude towards it. So you know it's not it's not a money thing at all. The set up Lin is to pay a cost for being tangled with hostile forces against China, and used to learn that she could play up to her circle in Canada through defaming China and then strive to reach the broad mainland market. Meanwhile, China's foreign ministry said the country will handle foreigners' exit and entry according to its laws. Lin's activism on freedom of speech and religion not only crushed her chances of competing in this world, but also strained her relationship with her father. He is still living in China after her parents divorced, after Lin won the Miss World Canada competition. She says her father received threats from Chinese authorities. They also are um, opposed to homosexuality. And actually, the, the, Bay, Area, uh, the Bay Area Reporter, that newspaper, um, a newspaper that supports gay rights, uh, published an article about them. And because they came to the following on position of homosexuality, came to light during a debate in Chinatown, whether, whether or not they should be marching in a parade in Chinatown. And they're also opposed to women's rights. Yeah, that's right, and they're also opposed to, they have racial views also, that yes. races shouldn't be mixed or something? They don't believe their races should be mixed, and they believe, for example, that uh, Christianity and Buddhism are somehow deeply incompatible, so that you know, Buddha, people in the East should practice Buddhism, people in the West should, uh, should practice Christianity, and you know, Sam knows more about this than me, so and this is an interesting point. I want to refer to what, what Sam knows about this, because it's really a... Well, I can give uh, one of uh, Lee's quotes about homosexuality. Uh, Lee's strongest words against gays come, uh, comes from a lecture in Switzerland. Uh, homosexuality was one of the factors that led to the uh, collapse of the Greek civilization, he said. Uh, furthermore, quote, Homosexuals 
not only violate the standards that God sets for uh, for mankind, but also damage human society's mor uh, moral code. In particular, the impression impression it gives children will turn future societies into something demonic and he descri Lee describes a special kind of suffering for homosexuals they, uh, they will be made to undergo a particularly uh, slow and painful annihilation uh, quote that person is annihilated layer after layer at a, at a rate that seems pretty uh, rapid to us but in fact it's extremely slow in that time field over and over again, one is annihilated in an extremely painful way. That's what he has to say about gays. Even though Falun Gong says it has no leaders. Even though Falun Gong says it has no leaders. Li Hangzi. This allegation is absurd, but why is it still being told outside China?